What's happening guys? My name is Max, this is my uncle Harley, and today we are going to be checking out Youngji and Jisoo from Blackpink. Now, if you're new to my channel, I'm a communication skills coach, and what I do on this channel is I look at all different types of people's communication skills. And recently, I've been bringing my Uncle Harley on board for some reactions and analysis. Uncle Harley is a psychologist, so it's been fun hearing his expertise. We've done a few videos together, and we decided today we're going to check out this very popular interview with Jisoo and Youngji. That sounds exciting. I've enjoyed working with you, Maxwell, so this has been fun. And now we have a chance to do Blackpink. Yes. And uh, I've seen them perform in a video. Oh, okay. Exceptional. Exceptional. I was ask yeah, you, yeah, they really bring it. Awesome. Let's get right into this. I was in Finland, and I was in Finland. This is what? It's a genie. But this genie is the third one. The third one. We're going to finish the last one. So, we're going to finish the last one. We're going to finish the last one. <laughs> what a sense of humor. <laughs> yeah, she's wild. Yeah. She's wild. But she's an artist as well. She, she, uh, Young G's uh, an artist as well. I haven't heard her. I haven't heard her stuff. But, but this show that she's been doing, where she's interviewing all these different K-pop stars and celebrities, mm -hmm. um, it's gotten quite a bit of love. She's and a character can... in herself, so you'd be drawn just to watch her. Exactly. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> the, the interview is greeting Jisoo, Jinsu? Jisoo. Jisoo? Yeah. <laughs> As her yeah. best friend. She yeah. walks in and yeah. she's like, the, the total comfort immediately between the two of them. And it's like, come on in, let's have some laughs right For from sure. the get go. For sure. Yeah. It's a good way of greeting your guests. You I know? would think. Yeah. I, I'm assuming she's never met. That's a good question. I, that's a good question. I wonder if they have met. <laughs> Jisoo seems to be matching Young Ji's energy pretty well too. Like she's not shying away from it. She seems to be embracing the energy. No, you're right. Because I, I noticed too that she's not intimidated by her whole shtick. Exactly. Because she could easily be taken aback and saying, "Whoa, this girl's a lot of energy yeah. here and a lot of talk and yeah. a lot of funniness." Yeah. I could just be an audience. Yeah, exactly. But she's, but she's taking part in the. She's taking part in the, in you're in right. the performance for Very sure. Much so yeah. <laughs> 뭔 소리야? 잠깐 언니 그건 아닌 것 같아. 신문지를. 그러니까 이제 유치원 때막 이렇게 종이접기 같은 거 하면은 색종이 여기 접다가 먹어봤어요 이렇게 맛이 없는 거예요. 그래서 집에 갔는데 신문 이렇게 먹었는데 신문지 좀 짭짤한 맛이. 잠깐 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 잠깐. 먹어봤다는 게 빨아 먹어봤다는 거 아니면 씹어서 넣 넣어봤다는 거야? 진짜 이렇게 먹다가 어떻게 끊게 됐냐면은 휴지가 있는데 휴지. Jisoo seems cool. Like I, I like yeah. how she kind of just opened up about that. She seems yeah. pretty relaxed. You know, yeah. she's not afraid to look silly or goofy. No, she was, she, yeah, she wasn't being embarrassed or no. she wasn't sort of like being hesitant about expressing it. She seemed very self-confident, saying, this is, I'm a goofy too. And exactly. That's all right. They're both kind of finding that out, that they can both sort of connect on that, on that level together. Exactly. So that's fun. I just want to mention about yeah. Jinsu too. Yeah. Now she's talking about how she's she was shy. she was shy. She's self admitting that. Yes. And and she's saying I had to look up stuff about you. I wanted to learn about you because I wanted to feel like I know what I'm doing when I meet with you. That says a lot about her personality. You know, she's a person that that kind of like likes to plan things, likes to have her life organized. You know, she doesn't want to have random things happen right. to her. That's an interesting point though yeah. that says about her personality. She doesn't like the maybe doesn't like unpredictability, right? Yeah. Wants to know what's going on. Right, yeah, right. That's Needs to be in control. Huh? Yeah. <laughs> Jisoo seems really mature. You know, I think she she's really entertained by Young Ji. You can tell she's like she appreciates her, but just the way she carries herself, she, she's That's able true. to have fun and let loose, 
but um, she's not composure. childish. Yeah, no, she she mature composure. Yeah, she throughout. maintains her composure. Yeah, yeah, that's what I'm noticing. Mama <laughs> 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 oh, <geez. Wow. laughs> and notice how Jisoo took zero offense, it seemed like. Yeah. To, you you uh, caught that too. Yeah, yeah. To Young Ji saying to her, you were the most, you were awkward, awkward. when I met yeah, you, right? Like, yeah. that's not something you necessarily to say to someone that you just met. <laughs> Young Ji feels like they have enough of a rapport and that Jisoo gets her enough that she can say that. Because Young Ji's smart. She comes across as someone who it could be all about her, right. but then you quickly learn that it's actually really all about the guests, and it's all about entertainment for the guests, and it's all about right. making the guests feel right. special, and it's all about, it's all actually for her audience. It's right. not actually bring this attention to right. me. That's what it seems like. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you know, Maxwell, yeah. I, I, here was an opportunity for Jinsu to kind of like pop out and do her thing. But you could see she's very reserved mm -hmm. because... Yeah, she had an opportunity. She had an opportunity that, that cup to like, or yeah, rather yeah. with the bottle. Be like, yo, alcohol for the yeah, future. Yeah, yeah. Whatever, yeah. Yeah. But she looked a little uncomfortable taking mm -hmm. it too far. She she made a little quip about it, yeah. and then kind of went off of it. Yeah. It's kind of a, tra a strange dichotomy, because she's so much accustomed to the public viewing that you can see how well composed she is, but she's not 100% comfortable getting beyond that and sort of like diving into this crazy character. Mm -hmm. She's still, she, she's very reserved, mm -hmm. you know? She's reserved, I guess. Maybe getting on stage allows her just to kind of get out of that, yeah. that shell. Just hearing that she's about to do a solo career. Again, just looking at her sort of reserved personality. She's still confident enough to get up on stage or to do uh, by herself. You can't underestimate that. I mean, no. in terms of sort of the, the confidence and, and the perseverance it takes, especially for someone who feels shy and, you know, inside at their core. So she probably has to work very hard at shedding That's a good that. point. That's yeah. a really good point. <laughs> <laughs> no. She's hilarious, man. Oh, she is. She's making fun of her moves and what she's singing about, and it's all in good fun. You know, I, I think this is also yeah. disarming from a interviewer perspective. Like, when you can just kind of put yourself out there and, and right. be okay with making a complete goof of yourself. Right. That also, I think, helps put your guest at ease as well. It's like... I'm out there. I'm an idiot. Like yeah. it's all good. Like yeah. you don't have to yeah. be perfect either. Is essentially what she's saying. Youngji said. Youngji, 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 Youngji. Oh, I drank it. Ah, water will drink. Oh, water will drink. Ah, water will drink. She's wild. Yeah, very funny girl. Very funny. You want to drink? Yeah. You want to drink? Yeah. You want to drink? Yeah. You want to drink? I like how Jisoo's kind of bringing the audience in now. Like she's kind of looking at the production team over yeah. and over again, yeah. like trying to get them involved yeah. here. Like she's crazy. She's crazy. Like that's sort of what she's implying here. Exactly. You know. And I, and she's developing a relationship too. Sort of us. It's almost like a security blanket. She yes. She sees that they're laughing and she can laugh along with them. And but she hasn't broken down her bonds yet. Young Ji hasn't broken down Su Jin Su uh, Jisoo? Jisoo's sort of like like. Composure. She hasn't like she's. You can still see yeah, that she's still. Yeah, you're right. Still, she hasn't like fully broken her. Yeah. There's moments where There's she'll moments. laugh yeah. genuinely and kind yeah. of, but then she'll collect herself. Right. I think that if I had to kind of get a sense of, of of sort of her upbringing, she was somebody that was um, expected 
to do the right thing. Yeah. She has that sort of approach, you know. She's yeah. she's she doesn't drink. She does yeah. for the most part. And you know, she's she not letting herself get completely silly and ridiculous. So she's right. you know working at kind of keeping her composure. And it's almost like you have to do the right thing. It's, I'm just getting that feeling, you know, when there were some jokes, she kind of put her hands over her face and yeah. smiled. It's more of a cultural thing as well. It's more of a cultural thing. Yeah. But I, 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 I think that she's very self-aware in terms of how she's presenting herself and making sure that her behavior is within a certain mm. con confines of what she's been told or what she believes needs to be um, a good girl. <laughs> 벌써 너무 무서워. 뭐가 무서워? 심장이 뛰니까. 뭐가 심장이 뛰어? 언니 코찰나 메인 무대 섰을 때 심장이 떨리는 거지. 고작 이거 하고 심장이 뛰어. 은우 그런 건안 떨려요. 그런 거안 떨려. 언니가 슈퍼스타라는 거야. 슈퍼스타. 나도 언니랑 똑같이 산다. 나 지금부터 지수 인스타그램 정독하고. She was just talking about the upcoming Coachella performance. Yeah, yeah. Uh, performance. Yeah. Young G was saying, "Wouldn't that would make me nervous?" G said, "No, that doesn't make me nervous." Interesting. And right? It is interesting. She's kind of a very complex person. Young you know, G, she, G Sue. Yeah, yeah, a self-described shy person. Right. And saying, "I'm coming out to this humongous performance. Yeah. Hundreds of thousands of people are going to be watching me and listening to me, and uh -huh. I don't feel nervous." And there's a term in psychology called self. Efficacy, mm -hmm. and what that means is a feeling of competence that you mm. feel competent, not just confident, but right. competent in, in certain situations. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And you could see that Jisoo has that sense of self-efficacy. She feels she feels comfortable and confident mm -hmm. right there in this situation. Mm -hmm. When it comes to to performing, yeah, see, I know I can I can yeah. handle this. I'm not nervous. Yeah. Um, but that, anyway, that that particular term is relevant because it speaks to a person that that is that is uh, strong in character mm -hmm. um, and that generally is successful in life yeah. because they, they feel like they're able to achieve things. Right. So you go into a situation not nervous, yeah. but you go in thing. I know I can handle yeah, this. Exactly. And so yeah. she's giving off that type of comment yeah. and, and and personality type. Oh, wait, honey. Oh, 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 Right. Sort of indicating that she's willing to take it to those those places and, right. and be open and in a sense no vulnerable in a sense. And then on top of that, the the point she made was that the next morning I'm fine. 우울할 때도 있지만 뭐 그래도 금방 자고 일어나면 괜찮아지는 정도. This is a person that's able to control their emotions and doesn't get lost in them. So that's a good point. The fact that she can regroup after feeling badly about yeah. something again that speaks to a really strong character and, a, and, a, and as she's saying, someone who's yeah. uh, strong of mind. Yeah, she does. She does. I yeah. mean, if you're going to get to that level, you have to have that resilience and that resilience, that, that absolutely strength and character. Mm -hmm. And I think you're right. She does have that. We're seeing that. That's a that's a yeah. good observation. Stadium이나 약간 이런 넓은 공연장의 규모를 약간 사람 꽉 채운 스타일이잖아. 언니랑 블랙핑크가. 근데 나는 소규모의 공연장에서 공연하다가 집에 와도 되게 허무함을 많이 느끼는 사람인데 언니나 블랙핑크 같은 분들은 더 그런 걸 많이 느낄 것 같단 말이야. 근데 저는 또 되게 단순하거든요. 그냥 뭐다 살아가니까 나도 이걸 하는 게 살아가는 거고. She just uh, she just does her own thing, right? She marches to the beat of her own drum. Mm -hmm. She doesn't really it sounds like compare herself to others and I think there's a, no. a there's a lesson in strength there, right? I got the sense that she grew up thinking I want to present a, in a in a way that people see me as respectable right. and as capable. And right. I think that that's just her own character it has nothing to do with being a performer. That whatever she chooses to do in life, she wants to do it exactly, in a way that it, that she's presenting it in a way that would be acceptable in in a like a morally acceptable way as well. And uh, uh, she's just so comfortable in her own skin, dude. It seems like it, huh? It. Yeah. yeah. 언니는 굉장히 그런 건강한 사람인가? 혼자서도 건강하고 혼자서도 독립적이. 혼자 잘 살기는 한 거죠. 가끔 막 혼자 있으면 너무 공허해서 그치? 친구라도 만나야 그치? 되고 막. 전또 그건. 그건 혼자 있으면 되게 설레요. 진짜. 와. 오늘 하루 
내 거. 완전 아니다. 오늘 하루 내 거. 완전 아니다. 막 방송에서 이제 가주세요. 그래서 저는 G s u is almost starting to like dominate the conversation, like in terms of her poise and the flow. And Young G is kind of yeah, and saying, "Whoa, this person's got it." Way more together than I thought. <laughs> we we just you know there's more than just playing with these games here. For sure, I've got a very mature, intelligent person sitting across from me, and I think she's kind of like I'm not sure where to go with this. I at yeah. times just at this point. 솔직히 누가 데뷔할 때부터 막 우리 좀잘될것 같아 막 이런 사람 없잖아. 막 우리는 어떻게 될까? 막 이렇게 하잖아요. 근데 올라가면 갈수록 뭔가 이렇게 변할 수도 있는데 그치? 별 생각이 없어 그런 거에. 스트레스는 안 받는 것 같아. 그러니까 막 어. 이게 어쨌든 정점 있으니까 언젠가 내려오는 길이 있을 텐데 우리가 내려가면은 올라가는 사람도 있을 거니까 그치. 우리 한국이 되게 이렇게 좀. She doesn't take herself too seriously because when asked what's going to happen if Blackpink goes down, and she's like, that's okay. Yeah, yeah. Somebody else will. It's going to happen eventually. Yeah. yeah, and somebody else will go up. Yeah. 좀 있어 내려가면은 올라가는 사람도 있을 거니까. 그치. Yeah. I don't think of myself as any better than anybody yeah. else, and when it's time for me to. To yeah. fade into the background, well, so be it. Yeah, I'm not that, worried that, about that would it. be an immense amount of pressure as well to live yeah. life that way. Like exactly. we gotta like maintain this top position. And yeah. it, it, interesting that uh, Young G picked that up, like yeah. as a question. You yeah, know, yeah. how do you feel about the pressure, and if you're yeah. not going to be on top, uh, that's a legitimate question. 뭔가 사람들이 생각하기에는 그래도 블랙핑크 너무 입지가 높은 집단이다 보니까 불화설 같은 것도 음, 괜히 추측하고 싶고 맞아, 맞아. 얘랑 얘가 사이가 안 좋다 얘랑 얘랑 사이가 안 우리는 좋다 우리는 그런 거 보면서 되게 웃어요 웃기잖아 야, 야, 야. <웃음> <웃음> 내가 널 견제하고 있대 조심해 빨리 열어 내가 진짜 야왜안 올려서 불화설 만들어 okay, oh, So they're not yeah. bothered by the criticism and exactly. they've got, it sounds yeah. like they're, they're really sort of strong as a group you know it they sounds are. like they're just They're one kind of unit yeah. that stick together. It's almost yeah. like you need that. You need that togetherness yeah. in yeah. order to deal with everything that comes your way. Because if you're not all on the same page, right. there's going to be chinks in the in, in your armor. 100%. And, and and you need to be that sort of force together. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And she's talking about we as a group when right. she talks about we don't look at these criticisms. We don't yeah. take it seriously. Right. Because if you know who you are as an individual right. and right. as a group, The criticisms right. aren't going to affect you in the same way, right? And that's just how it is, right? So that speaks to their confidence. Builds a to protective their... wall. Exactly. Yeah. We know who we are. We right. know we're close. 뒤따라 가는 길이 너무 편하게 됐어. 사람들이 한국어에 대해서도 관심을 가지고 한국 문화에 대해서도 관심을 가지고. 왜냐면 외국 팬들이 뭐 편지를 주면은 항상 한국어로 써 있고. 그러니까 막 되게 고마운 느낌이 강한 거야. 그러니까 막와막 되게 저게 뭐야? 저게 뭐야? 왜 음식점에 있는 그릇이? 뭐가? 뭐가? I think that she was saying something, Jisoo, that was very important in terms of insight as to how the group feels about the fans and how she feels about her fans. So she is very appreciative. Again, you know, that's, that's yeah. just awesome to see that, that that's taken in a very serious fashion. But after she makes that comment that she's thankful for her fans writing to her in Korean, she immediately looks off to something outside yeah. of that conversation and something caught her attention yeah. there yeah. and she wanted to be silly. I think that she probably would have been more serious A if she wasn't drinking yeah. and B if her interviewer wasn't you know, trying to keep the jokes right. running fast and furious. Right. So it, it's just too bad in that sense. I mean this is really an entertaining interview but I, 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 it would have been nice to see a little, little bit more, more depth. Yeah, a little bit more. There's a lot yeah, to this. There's woman. a lot going on. Yeah. yeah, and there's a lot to this woman. Exactly. Yeah. 맞아. 오, 완전 잘해. 도사님 같아. 내가 진수 그만해. Yeah, go home. You're making fun of me now. 먹어 먹어 또 나와. 멤버들 데리고 알겠지? That's a sign of closeness and comfort right yes. there. When you can make yeah. fun of someone. You know that your relationship's strong enough to withstand right. a little bit of humor, and, right, and I right. think I think when you want to get closer with someone and build on that connection, yeah. well, you got to push those boundaries a little. For at sure, times, right? 조심히 가. 언니 나 연락해. 허가 먹어야 될 거. 나 이렇게 가는 거야. 안녕 언니 잘 가. She'll bring her back in after, I'm sure. I would think. And you know. It, it was a kind on, on Young G's part, she kind, there was a kind of like a, a reverence for yeah. her, but at, yeah. the, at the same time, 
she she was able to make fun of her and sort of bring her down to just yeah. a, like a very human one of us kind of level but you could see that she recognizes yeah you are different you are a right. superstar she mentioned that a couple of times right. and you see that she really respected her exactly. a lot of respect a lot of respect yeah. in, in both yeah. ways and Jisoo I think showed yeah. her showed young Ji her gave her her props as well I think she was yeah. genuinely entertained by young yeah. Ji at yeah. times yeah but I'm uh, sure that she probably collapsed to the floor too. Oh, I'm <laughs> just, sure. just like Young G did. Uh, uh, I'm that sure. was that was a lot of that uh, was a lot of energy. To take in. Yeah, was a, a lot, lot of energy, energy in that room. Yeah, guys, we hope you enjoyed that. If you're interested in watching our uncut reaction and analysis, all you need to do is go to my Patreon link below. Other than that, we'll catch you soon. Peace. It's been a blast.